Hey there, welcome back. Today I'm going to China. After a little post made on my thread on the North America forums, I felt somewhat inspired to do a Flying Tigers episode, as you may have been able to gather from the intro I had. So here we have the Tier 5 Premium Curtis Tomahawk 2B, which is a P40. Or a model 81 something 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 something. It comes armed with six machine guns, the Tomahawk 2 airframe, and the Allison V 171033 engine. I am currently running it with engine tuning, a lightweight airframe, an improved radiator. My Chinese pilot has eagle-eyed, engine guru, and cruise light. I'm saving those two skills for... I'm not sure yet. It is currently wearing the American Volunteer Group camouflage pattern, but you may have noticed I don't have a shark's mouth. That is a nose art option that would cost you 75 gold totally complete the image there. Maybe I'll wait for a sale. Or maybe I get Hawkeye to make up a really nice skin for it. Hmm. Let's go. Is there anything special about this aircraft? Not really. I mean, if you have a regular P-40 that you can grind out on the American line, it's, it's this plane. If you break down and buy the Soviet Tier 5 P-40 M-105, some minor differences, it's this plane. This is the only Tier 5 plane available for the Chinese currently all premium line and I picked this up as a promo code a little while ago. I'm not much of a collector, but now I have all three premium Curtis P40 variants that are available in the game. I do like this plane. The problem I have with this because of those machine guns, you have to get in danger close to your opponents to get any kind of hurt on them. It is a flying paper shredder. It's actually kind of worse than a Spitfire Mark 1A, the Dunkirk edition, or the Tier 5 Spitfire Mark 1s. The 303s versus these 50 calibers are, you are approaching the area of combat operations. frustratingly slow in the damage dealing department. But this plane is tough. And if I fly it half as well as John Wayne did in the 1942 movie, I would be a happy guy. Half as well. I see Sky Wolf. WM in here. Pilots, get ready for action. Okay, let's go. So let's get that airfield. Let's see who follows me. It's a fantastic climber. It is borderline flexible. You can do boom and zoom in this plane quite nicely. Turn fighting is a little stiff, especially at the lower altitudes. So bear that in mind if you uh, if you happen to get one or you're considering on getting one. These are always available in the tech tree shop for China. And reasonably priced too. I mean, it's a tier five. It's not going to break the bank. I mean, for about the price of a meal to McDonald's with change back, you can get one of these. Come on, come on out. See, very stiff on the turning. Does not like to do it very well. It can do it, but it is very. taking a shopping cart to a go-kart track. You could do it, but, you know, whoever's pushing you is going to be very tired. Come on, come on. 
There we go. The airfield is ours. Utilize its Check advantage. Check the map. What do we got going on? Command center. Let's go down. Ooh, that's at the other side of the map. The problem is that command center over there is just loaded. Yeah, to support a push over there would not be a good idea, I don't think. Meanwhile, the progress looks more promising over here. Yeah, see, just would have turned it. Would have been, Bomber squadron detected. Would have been Engage fodder. Them immediately. Oh, runs out of boost too quick, though. And let's go. I got cruise flight, so that will help a bit. I'll probably get there just in time to watch those two go down. Yep. So in the meantime, we got a bomber flight coming in. So let's give them a little bit of a welcoming. And why not? It's a premium plane. Shoot stuff up, make some credits, come on. And it's not like you're going to attack a ground target with this thing, so I mean the guns aren't going to do nothing, so you might as well uh, go after something that's actually worthwhile. Hey, Handley Pages. Oh, no, the question is, can I tail ride with this plane? And by the looks of it, at this level, yes I can. The nice thing is because these are definitely machine guns. Oh, that's a cool bit. They do have a long heat cycle, so. We do have a heavy fighter coming in. I nice see you. Didn't think I'd see you. Aww. But, he gets away, unless he circles back. Oh, we just lost something. Oh, no, we're even money now. Mm -hmm. oh. Well, that was kind of cool. Select the spawn point. Well, let's go here. Really? That is my guy. Okay, come on guys. Do, 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 do. Uh -oh. Our command base is taking a bit of a hit. Come on. Are you not registering? Looks like you already dropped your ordinance. Ah, really? That's terrible. Yeah, because you're not showing up with any kind of health bars, I think. Yeah, I think they dropped their ordinance already. Yeah, they're starting their upward climb, so get a little bit of damage in them before they go. That'll help in the credit department. So we'll let a little stall fall happen, because that's okay. Oh, how's the battle progressing? Uh, oh, it's very slow in the points department. Very, very slow. Who needs some Field that's probably hurting down there, not too bad, but still in our position. Oh, I should have uh, get over there. So go for the trailing edge guy, and hopefully, these guys are not too. Hard. So hard to get a good, good. Well, is that really more worthwhile? Like, I'm getting. Yeah, I'm getting. Points, but that's about it. Like, personal points, is that what they're calling it now? Receiving reports about rapidly deteriorating weather conditions. Support will be unable to reach you. Uh, I need to get rid of that stuff, so I did think I saw somebody down here. The bombers are definitely 
hurting us there. Oh, there's somebody. What are you? A 2PL, really? Or a 2 pal, I should say. He's got a rear gunner. And he's trying to play chicken. That's okay. Hi there, welcome to Tier 5. Hope you enjoyed your stay. Storm here. Ooh. Unable to proceed. Return into base. Do you copy? Just keep it up. More Victory is almost over. Really, that's all I can do is pretty much. We're in pretty good shape for superiority. We have complete control of the sky. So I might as well just farm. I mean, the bombers are there. The team looks like it's in pretty good shape. Oh. Oh, I saw that. You did not drop that on my stuff. Bad. Is this irresponsible? I'm proud of I don't you, know. Head back home. Let's see how it turned. Wow, 7705. Number one. Archipelago. Well, let's see. It's a premium plane. So the whole premise behind them is to train your pilot. So take your pilot, train them up in your regular tech tree plane, get them to 100% proficiency, throw them in premium planes, and start building up your skill points. Ooh, very nice. What did I get? 92,000, and I'm not running a premium account. That's just straight off the plane farming. That is very nice. And of course, I still don't have a foam for the microphone, so you're getting the foo. 92,000 with a tier 5? That's impressive. Top dog on both teams. Wow. A 2PA. And that's not even very high. Not very high at all. Hmm. And the other premise behind premium planes is to generate credits for when you get into higher tiers and the economy does not favor your performance no matter how good you are. Yes, there are exceptions to every rule and there's some players out there going, well, I can make money in tier 8, tier 9 regular planes. Well, not everybody can though. You are special. If you liked what you saw, give me a thumbs up, consider subscribing to my channel, leave comments in the section below. If you didn't like what you saw, or if there's something I should have done that was different other than the outcome that we produced, by all means leave some constructive criticism for me to read over, review, and reevaluate my uh, strategies within the future. Thanks for watching, and until next time, take care.